Hey guys, it's me, Cupid. I have schizophrenia. Today I wanted to talk about niacin. Niacin is something that has been discovered as a treatment for schizophrenia. Niacin, um, I mean, it can work. So let's talk about how it can work. Um, niacin helps to metabolize uh, adrenochromes. Adrenochromes come from adrenaline. Uh, people with schizophrenia do not naturally um, metabolize adrenochromes the way that we need to. So niacin helps and it can benefit because adrenochromes not metabolized correctly can cause hallucinations, delusions, other things like paranoia or anything like that that schizophrenia um, has. Um, so let's talk about why it doesn't work though, why it has its issues I should say. Um, one of the biggest things that, um, a, that uh, niacin can um, cause is liver damage. Uh, liver damage um, can be very deadly, obviously. Um, so it can cause liver damage anywhere from a thousand milligrams to uh, or more. Um, for someone to have schizophrenia, they need to take a thousand milligrams to three thousand milligrams per day. And that, again, can be deadly. Um, another thing is that it causes other side effects like a uh, burning face. I had taken it and it caused me to my whole face to burn up and to, to the point where my, my brain felt like it was boiling. Um, so that is just some of the um, bad reactions. Um, so some other side effects are uh, severe skin flushing combined with dizziness, um, rapid heartbeat, uh, itching, nausea and vomiting, abdominal pain, diarrhea, gout, and diabetes. So again, that is a bad thing. Um, niacin is vitamin B3, so we do need niacin in our body. We just don't want that much niacin. Um, and, I mean, of course, again, it can work for some. Like I've said in the past, um, certain treatments that work for one person may not work for the other, and so um, certain treatments that work for one person, you know, another treatment can work for another person. It really just depends on what works for your body, how your body um, reacts to these kinds of things. So um, I figured that I would talk about this stuff because I wanted you guys to learn more about a treat learn more about treatments for schizophrenia because I think there are more treatments out there than you probably know. Um, I have another video that I want to do on Bacopa um, or Brahmi, which is um, the treatment that I have been taking that has worked for me. It is amazing. It has been my saving grace. Um, and I really do want to do a video where I talk about that so that you guys can have some more information about that. Again, I like to talk about things that I've tried. Um, if I haven't tried it, I don't have enough information, so I'll give you what I do have in my research. But if I've tried it on myself, then I will have more information to provide for you. Um, another great, um, well, there's other great treatments that I will talk about in the future, um, but for now, those are the, the videos that I'm going to be doing. Um, please subscribe. I would love it if you guys could subscribe. I, um, I love doing these videos for you guys, and I love hearing from you guys. Um, also, um, like the video, comment, let me know if you guys have tried niacin, if it works for you what information you have on nice and um, other treatments that you guys may have that worked. Um, I would love to hear from you guys. I really do enjoy hearing from you guys. Um, so other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful rest of your week. Oh, and by the way, I wanted to share my shirt. Um, it says, sounds gay, I'm in. That is um, my shirt for Pride Month. <laughs> um, yeah, anyways. Showing some pride here. Uh, anyways, you guys, have a great week. Um, great rest of your day. Um, please stay safe, you guys. Peace and love. Bye.